Wow, this conversation is hot. And guys on Twitter, you are not lacking because you're talking about some of the uh, some of the thoughts you're sharing uh, with us about weed. And someone says, Kevin Onyango says, and since Kenyans know much about its negative effect than its positive effects, we do not want it to be legalized. Thank you very much, Kevin Onyango, for sharing uh, that. Someone is asking, Yitzhak Mawea is actually asking, are you sure that it should be legalized? That's the big question. Uh, someone else, Vincent Osoro says, I think the government is supposed to legalize Bangi. Wow. Churchill says majority of, the, uh, of those fighting the legalization of marijuana are the multinational companies that make cigarettes. Speaking of which, it's actually going to uh, give us direction in this one. The big question is, should le uh, weed be legalized? And of course, right now, I just want you to take a look at your TV screen. We actually had an opportunity to talk to this researcher. He's called Ogot. You, you need to look at your TV screens. He's actually talking about how uh, he's comparing cigarettes and weed. Take a look at your TV screen. CCR. out where cigarette smoking is allowed, where a cigarette is sell, sold off the counter, cigarettes cause much more deaths per annum and cannabis does, is not known to have caused a single death anywhere in the world. There's no record and yet we sell cigarettes. Yeah, I have a panel in studio right now and that's what Ogot has actually said that kunashida zingine mingi sana when it comes to drugs compared to just marijuana, I don't... I, do you think it's true? Because they're talking about multinationals that are supporting cigarettes. Wanajua is going to be competition if they legalize marijuana. Do you think that people are afraid of the businesses being spoiled? Actually, it's more of creating more job opportunities than uh, what they're saying. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because as much as, yes, it's bringing competition, that's another opportunity for the jobless youths. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's so many dockets. When you say jobless youths, uh, are you... Are, in what aspect are you looking at weed? Because are you looking at it from the now agricultural perspective? Ile kupanda weed? Because how, how will weed create jobs? It cuts across from the planting to the, to the manufacture, to the sales. You see, once you legalize it, then as he has said, it is over the counter. Mm -hmm. You see, now you can actually benefit from it just the same way they, they sell cigarettes and mm -hmm. alcohol. Cigarettes? alcohol, codeine, which is contained in some of the over-the-counter uh, drugs. Talk to me, don't you think that it's actually more to blame when it comes to uh, drug abuse? Um, what exactly? Say that again. I'm saying that there are other drugs yes. uh, compared to marijuana that cause a bad effect on the youth. Let's say addiction yes. and stuff like that. I'm mm. talking about codeine in some of the syrups, yes. over-the-counter syrups. Yes. And of course, we're looking at cigarettes, which is one of uh, them that causes cancer. And uh, also, uh, uh, there's so many other different drugs, like alcohol. Talk to us about, in comparison to other drugs, what do you think? Is weed really dangerous? The point is, we cannot compare two negatives to get a positive. Mm -hmm. In the sense, we cannot legalize, we cannot uh, argue mm -hmm. that it is good to legalize marijuana mm -hmm. because, uh, because there are other drugs mm -hmm. that, that, that also have adverse effects. Mm -hmm. Then the question would be, are we helping society or we are messing it up? Mm -hmm. yeah. Is it a rich man's problem or a poor man's problem when we say that? Because uh, I'm actually reading a tweet here that says, is only she does a mababi. On what, on what perspective are we talking about that? That's someone called Samuel, who's actually shared that. He's only she does a mababi. Legalizing it is only she does a mababi. Do you think, compared to the, the, comparing the social classes, do you think that it's mostly used amongst the, okay, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. I, let's break the classes <laughs> into three. <laughs> I almost say less fortunate, but it's, wow. that's not the one. <laughs> yes, yes. So do you think it's being used more by people who are, not, who are actually poor? economically compared to guys who are actually economically empowered? The point is, the people that are less economically empowered mm -hmm. are, are more in number, mm -hmm. one. Two, they have bigger mental issues to deal with in terms of stress, in terms of uh, poverty, in terms of depression and all those things. So the susceptibility of those guys on the lower chain to resort to drug abuse is of course higher. Mm -hmm. Yes. Memory loss is one, of, one amongst the attributes of using the drug for a long period of time, that is weed. 
And we'd like to just take a look at the TV screen right now and get to see some of the components in weed. We see some of the components uh, in weed. And it's actually super crazy to just get to know that weed contains a whole lot of things, even paraffin. <laughs> True, true to say that, but then there are components we can't be able to get the graphics uh, right now. But to keep our touch, Tawaza Kushia Nanyini, but so many people are actually vouching for it. Uh, go ahead and give the positive sides of it. That is Kevin Onyango who continues to say that. Uh, Smiley says, uh, <laughs> had the discussion with a friend, and his claim was at Utamwabangi ni kuvuta kuji feature. So legalizing it, it's a funny Do you think? People are looking at it from a very emotional perspective. Like, kitu poa nile unaiba. Because, uki achatu hivo. Okay, now I have the, the, the graphics right now. Health benefits. Let's look at that. Slow and stops cancer cells from spreading. Uh, prevents Alzheimer's. That is actually uh, memory loss. <laughs> okay, funny how it does. And also causes it. Uh, treats uh, glaucoma. And of course, relieve arthritis. Yeah, those are some of the things. That, those are health benefits. Do you agree, Isaac? Do you agree with that? That truly, those are the health benefits. That if it's used well, those are the benefits. Because Alzheimer's, Alzheimer's if you uh, old age, you start forgetting stuff. Um, the point is, everything God created, mm -hmm. He created it um, good. Mm -hmm. Now, the, 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 on the onset of sin, every other thing now became corrupt including mm -hmm. now weed mm -hmm. I, I i want so to is believe it a good plant or bad plant i want to believe it was a good plant at the beginning at the beginning i want to believe so. <laughs> i want to believe so because okay. look at it this way man was created good but after the fall mm -hmm. man got messed up mm -hmm. You get mm -hmm. it's the same comparison. Mm -hmm. So Tower. the question is, just we give me the response on the same Whoa. weed. Your health, uh, we health benefits. I don't think uh, any researcher will just give us false uh, information. Mm -hmm. And if up to now we still have such information of the importance of it, mm -hmm. I don't know why we still dwell on the negatives. You get mm -hmm. it's just like you, you should tell me the 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 importance of maybe alcohol or tobacco because you've told us that you can't take negative and negative to make a positive we want to legalize this thing that actually has more importance than what is already legalized mm -hmm. yeah i know you, you don't use weed like even you know parents by the this guy doesn't use weed but then the united there does it mean that the creative industry, by the way, most, you're in the creative industry. Do most of the people use it to get inspiration because it's been blamed for also things to do with inspiration? Now that health, uh, people are looking at it from a very uh, medicinal perspective and they don't want even to look at it from a point where you just hallucinate and you don't go to jobs, you don't, you don't attend your, your classes as well. So just talk to us about the same. Okay, as an artist, uh, I have seen people being messed up with the weed. Mm -hmm. That's a fact. Mm -hmm. But is it, does it create But to what, yeah, to what they tell me is they get into this zone, into this zone that they can actually think better. I usually feel it's a state of mind, but the fact that it has a... Uh, it has medicinal aspect of such kind of what they're telling me. Mm -hmm. I, I see it being legalized as something to be used by people in moderation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you think it's being used more because it's not legal? Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. It is being, um, the fact that it is illegal does not mean that it is not being used. Mm -hmm. sure. And you see, young people by nature, they are rebellious. That's 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 the, and now now that is my 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 issue with legalizing marijuana because now mm -hmm. you have given access to young people who are unpredictable to be free to do what they would want with that mm -hmm. thing. Listen to this. Yes. Mm -hmm. Twitter by the way is on fire. Someone who says who, who goes by the name part time for fair play. That's that's his name. <laughs> <laughs> Funny how uh, that's his name. And I said, these effects were discovered by which doctor? That's the question. It's a research paper actually done. Marijuana is good and medicinal, so stop lying to Kenyans. That's exactly what he says. What's your feedback on the same? I'll be asking you. Uh, okay, some more people who are also talking. Hey. Well, so. I'll, I'll be reading more, but what do you think? Easy research, do you think that there are actually people who fund 
so that these findings are actually manipulated or doctored? I actually don't think so. I think and they I, are correct. I actually, we'll make that your final remarks. Join it with your parting shots. I think they are correct. Mm -hmm. uh, marijuana can be used for medicinal purposes. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. But now, the question would be, with the risks involved in uh, legalizing it, are there no equivalent um, uh, whatever components or other medicinal plants that we can get that can sort those kind of issues mm -hmm. to an extent that now we save a generation mm -hmm. uh, without necessarily have to legalize marijuana. So you still feel that weed should not be legalized? Yes. Wow. All right. Uh, personally, I wanted to touch on something he has said. Once you legalize it, then you give the youth a platform to use it. I want to compare it with uh, the ban of shisha. Mm -hmm. uh, before it was banned, I don't think it was that rampant. Like right now, uh, they are doing it because it is illegal. Just the same way you've said, youth are rebellious. Mm -hmm. uh, the intake has been higher of shisha. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling that the reverse can actually happen to weed. If you legalize it, just the same way somebody has said, then I think it will actually be, be a little bit uh, decreased. I don't know if you're getting what I'm saying. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much, gentlemen, for actually creating time to be here. Parting shot, yako ni watu watumia wasi tumi. What was it to me? <laughs> Baka iku legalized. Because then they will be told how it is used. Ciao, Powell. <laughs> Ciao, Powell. And of course, Isaac Ongai, thank you very much for creating time to be here with us. So I'm going to read you some more feedback. Hapa hivi kidogo. Dennis Japesa, yawa yawa. Anasema, what is of more importance is life. <laughs> the rest are scams. Don't add value uh, to my breathing space. So I'm not proud of myself. So Anasema, we should not use weed. Asante sana. And of course, who else is joining us? Canasta Fox says that we should not 